my name is Steve. I am a 50-year-old medical marijuana patient. I live here in uh, San Diego, California. Welcome to the boys' room. I get together with my brothers and we live our boys' life in this little area. At the same time, at 50 years old, I can respect my wife, stay out of the living room or whatever with my buddies, smoking pot. I've been smoking pot since I was 15 years old, self-medicating myself for uh, problems I guess I've had since uh, childhood where I went through therapy for ADHD and bipolar disorder, manic depression. So I would buy a pot because I knew when I smoked it, it calmed me down, allowed me to, to work inside of a frame of mind that was productive. I have arthritis, like I said, ADHD, bipolar disorder. I've taken every antidepressant you can think of. Um, and, and all of them work to some degree, but they have these horrible side effects. You know, your hair falls out or your uh, parts of you don't work. Um, like I said, I've been self-medicating for a long time. I didn't like feeling guilty, and I wanted to be above board, and after the Proposition 215, I guess, came, um, I decided I wanted to get my license under referral. And what was nice was how much I discovered once I became above board, the, um, the different types of strains that were available to me, the different ways that those things responded to me. The pharmaceutical, um, I, I call them really hard drugs. Well, you take those, you either go to sleep or it, it messes you up. I mean, there's, there's problems metabolically with the way they work for me. Medical marijuana is an opportunity to have a great medicine available to help people cope with the problems they have every day. The advantages of knowing the different strains, just like different medicines. you got to have a caregiver who understands the dynamic and match it to your symptoms. And that's when it all kind of comes together. Nothing has ever worked for me the same way.